Good morning! It is Sunday and it is the start of a whole new week. I just got off from work and I am ready to go home. But first, okay Google, what time does Publix Liquors open up? Oh, gosh darn it, it's too early. It's only 8 o'clock in the morning. Yes, it is 8 o'clock in the morning. But I worked all night and it is like 8 p.m. for me. Ah! Oh, oh my god. Seriously, over this past week, I've had so many close encounters of running into birds. Like they would just fly out and they'd be flying so close to my car that it just scares the jeepers out of me. And that was the third time. I just wanna go home and drink a glass of wine. Last night was very different for me. I was put in the charge nurse role and I, I was scared. I didn't know what the heck I was doing. I didn't know what to do. And I mean, in the end, everyone is alive. <laughs> so I guess I did something right. But I did have a team that helped me. But I realized I am not up for this charge nurse position. I don't want to do it. I have a hard time saying no, especially to my superiors. So I was guilt tripped into being charge nurse. I had a patient while also trying to take care of our whole ICU unit and we made it out okay. But whew, it was, it was, it was crazy. Watching the live stream of Ultra Music Festival. Right now they're closing out with Swedish House Mafia and I wish I was there, but I definitely don't mind being in bed as well. The only thing is I'm feeling really pumped up from all this music, but I'm just like laying here, so inside I'm like, yeah, let's party, and then on the outside I'm like, this. Worked out this morning, check. Got a breakfast sandwich from Panera, check. And now time to go to my new favorite coffee place, Bold Cup Coffee. Got myself a chai latte. I'm whispering because I'm the only one here. When I first came in, the music was playing jazz, and then the barista put on some Beauty and the Beast background music. Running errands and getting some wine because I'm not gonna make that mistake. Gotta make sure I have my wine stash just in case for days like the other day. I gave Cherry her first Kinder egg. What do you think, Cherry? It kind of tastes like a Ferrero Rocher, but like with white chocolate and without the nuts. What did you get for your toy, Cherry? Oh, I didn't look. It's I'm also there. watching Ultra Still. Yeah, it's in there. Ooh. Have you not gotten this one? I, no, I think they're like all different. Heck is it? I don't know. Cherry, are you having a good time? Make some noise if you are. Wait, you have to use the egg. What the heck am I using the egg for? But I don't know, but it has the egg there. I have no idea what this I'm thing so is. Confused. Why is this for kids? Okay, and then you put the top on. Is this just to stabilize it? Or am I just supposed to do that? <gasps> Wait, and then what do you it? do? I think that's it. I literally think that's it. I don't like this one. I don't like this one either. I think it's creative, but it's difficult. Spin it and then move it. Oh God, that was fast. Now Kiwi has her own Kinder Egg toy. I think Kiwi got a cool one. Wait, there's instructions right here, Kiwi. Oh. It's a robot. Wow. Oh. What, what? Why'd she get a robot? Because I gave her the good one. I get the last one then. You really have nothing else better to vlog? Yeah, it's been a slow year so far. I got a skateboard! Ooh, that's cool. That's up your alley, actually. I got a ramp. Oh, that's cool. That's sick. And I got stickers for my ramp. Oh, dope. Wait, it's already a skateboard? You don't have to build it? Nope, oh. it's already a skateboard. So all you have to do is put stickers on it? Yep. Ooh. Do a flip. Do it. I have no idea how to fingerboard. Do the sick tricks, Cherry. No. <gasps> There's your robot. Let me see. Cool. What does it do? He moves. He's a robot. He just he just moves. Mm. Oof! This here is a mess. One of my projects for the day is to get these t-shirts made for my family vacation next week on the cruise. My mom wanted us to wear matching shirts, so my mom got t-shirts, and then I made a design, and then. Cherry and her friend um, create it online or on the computer and for today I'm going to print it out on like these iron transfer paper then iron it onto the shirts. 
I'd never done this before. It looks easy, but at the same time, I barely use an iron, so I'm not like well acquainted with that. But let's see if it works. This is the paper. I think it goes like this. Okay, print. Printer is low on toner ink. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, I printed it on the wrong way. All right, gonna print out another one. Okay, I believe that's the right side. So I had to reprint it with the blue outline because as you can see, you can't see the font on the white paper. What do you think? This is going to be a practice run. Go right here. It smells like armpit. Ew. All right, it is completely cooled down and now we take this off. Oh, shizna. Oh man, the font came out transparent and not white. So as you can see, it's really blended into the shirt and doesn't stand out too, too much. So I've been working on this t-shirt for like,